the former president of an IT venture company which specialised in the development of supercomputers, was sentenced on March 25, 2020 at Tokyo's District Court for crimes which included the theft of government subsidies. 52-year-old Saito Motoaki was accused of hiding around $8 million worth of income in order to evade tax and of stealing nearly $6 million worth of government subsidies which had been designated to support the development of supercomputers. The defence, in response to the prosecution's demands for an eight-year prison sentence, pleaded for a verdict which included probation and absolved their client of any guilt for the charges which related to tax evasion. On the day of sentencing, Chief Justice Nohara Toshiro of the Tokyo District Court, in reference to the charges of tax evasion, stated, As the former president of a corporate group that was heavily laden in debt, you were the main instigator behind tax evasion and committed such acts as ordering your workers to create contracts which contained fictitious invoices as well as personally carrying out wire transfers. Regarding the theft of government subsidies, he added, Whenever public funds are used to advance development, capital is expected to be transparent in nature. However, the attitude of the defendant was directed towards personally promoting his own research findings and was entirely self-serving. The cost of betraying the public trust cannot be taken lightly. The defendant was sentenced to five years in jail.